I think the purpose of the junior youth program is to help youth develop like throughout their lives and help them like like help them gain knowledge and what like what to do and what to, not to do when they grow up. To learn about new stuff. Helping people. Uh, to get some skills for later on in life. Uh, the purpose of the junior youth group is like to uh, to spend time with your friends and also to make new friends and yeah and learn some life lessons along the way. You can see all of your pretty much close friends. Fun to hang out with my friends. It's nice, beautiful, and you can make new friends. I like to come to group because like I can hang out with all these cool people and like. We also do projects that help the community, like once we collected a whole bunch of blankets to give to homeless people who are cold. That's not nice to be cold. It's not good. I believe it's supposed to better ourselves, to be better humans, because as you may know, being a teen, youth type thing is very hard, and it has always been hard. but. It's nice to have um, people around to like guide us, and by people I mean books. We read books. And I guess a lot of challenges of being youth is like making other people understand you, like around your communities, like your teachers, your parents. Everyone ex expects better from you, and like making everyone like like making everyone like be on the same level and understand you is like the hardest thing of like the hardest part of being a youth. That's what I think. Challenges are like, not so easy in life. It's hard to connect to other people. Sometimes you go, okay, blah, blah. Because people your age are very hard to talk to mm -hmm. now. Because, like, it's the age where you're like, I want to be cool. Adults are hard to talk to for many reasons. You guys, it's hard. And then children are like, oh, they're children. I don't want to talk to them. So it's like, you can't connect to anyone. So you're just trying to like find a place. Um, people have anxiety, mental depression, and it's really hard to like go to school to have those two battling, and you have stress building on mental health and anxiety. At school, um, um, making friends, making new friends, because like, I mean, um, I I bet at every school there's like this group that like to call themselves cool and like you want to hang out with them but then like but then they don't accept you because you don't do the same things that they do so and um and then if you do the same things they do I mean like it might be good stuff but then like most of the times it's not it's bad stuff so yeah so it's hard to pick would you hang out with them or would you hang out with them Strathcona is a beautiful community. Do not ruin it with drugs and litter or something, you know? Youth can change the community by like contributing through it, like helping other people, maybe like talking to adults and learning and teaching like little kids or helping contribute towards the community by maybe like doing things like probably like nice words or helping out cleaning up the community and making sure the community is like neat and not dirty. Well if anyone's hurt, mm. like let's say something happens, you get hurt, it would be nice to just knock, just say hi to the dog, ask someone for help and they don't go, no. Helping those who need it. The youth can help the people who need help to be helped. By not throwing the garbage and stuff on the ground and like polluting the earth more. It's hard because for some people it might be like, what can children do? They're just children. And like children might feel that way too. But like, it's really almost the most important time to like do things because people are going to listen to you because you're a child. And if you're like saying a bunch of smart things and they're like, wait. Maybe I'm thinking something wrong here, so it's a good time to do.
do things. The betterment of the world can be accomplished through pure and godly deeds through commendable and seemly conduct.